Hey guys, it's Clarence. So in today's video, I wanted to do a little challenge. We're gonna be going on a Walmart haul. I know like brands are like a huge thing. Well, I literally love brands, but I wanted to go get creative with all their things that they have. Let's see what I can do. I'm gonna call it like the Walmart outfit challenge. So with that being said, let's go. So just a little context for the next couple seconds of this video. Right before I left, my friends were begging me to listen to Megan Thee Stallion and Cardi B's new song. And so I played it on the way to Walmart and this was my reaction. That's what WAP stands for. What's your profanity? So the first thing I got was this plain reddish brown button-up short sleeve. So let's make an outfit. Okay. This is the whole outfit. I paired it with white shoes, pants from forever. I put extra chains on it. This was pretty plain. So I wanted to add a little bit more detail to it. And that's the whole fit. Okay, so the next thing I got was this. <laughs> you better stop! Wolf tee. <laughs> I don't know, I saw like an Emma Chamberlain video where she was wearing like a cat tee and I remember when those were like the sh and I was like, oh sh she pulled it off. I'm gonna like try to copy it. I kind of freaks with this. So black shorts, white converse. <laughs> Looks like the kid in high school who thought he could dress, but I got it for like $5. So take that my over masculine bully in high school. Okay, I made another option. I did a white long sleeve shirt that I have and I just put the Walmart shirt over it. Light wash jeans with a black belt, high white socks, and normal bands. I don't think I would personally wear this. It's my e-boy outfit. Ahaha. <laughs> okay, so the next thing I got was a plain black sweatshirt. I've seen a lot of schoolboy outfits in this, so let's make an outfit. Oh! <laughs> this colored white shirt is also from Walmart. Black pants, white socks, white shoes. This is like if Brandy Melville wasn't overpriced and was for guys and has a size large. I'm feeling myself. Okay, so the next thing I got were a pack of wife beaters. These are the bomb. You get like six for like eight dollars and they go with everything like any jacket, any flannel. So I'm gonna make an outfit. Oh, I love a good white tank. Okay. Oh, I'm wearing two different shoes. There we go. So I wore the white tape from Walmart, a gold chain. To match the gold chain, I looked for a flannel that I had with yellow on it. I really like the trend right now where they do the shoelace as your belt with jeans to make it look like a little bit more casual. And then high socks again and black classic vans. Also very skater boy, but overall I think Walmart actually has a lot in terms of like the basics. So if you're balling on a budget, don't worry about it because Walmart's got you, their stores have got you. But this is the overall outfit and I really like it and yeah. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Again, I wanted to make this video because I think we can be creative with just going to like common stores like Walmart or Target or things like that. Like a lot of people who I admire for fashion like still go to them today, like even if they have the money for like big brands. And the big brand stuff is awesome. I would love to be able to afford all that stuff. But for now, like I just like being creative and I feel like this is a good way for me to prime myself for when I do have the money to buy brands and things like that. So thank you guys for watching. I hope this kind of helps you when it comes to your back to school shopping. Please like this video, comment any video ideas you have for the future and subscribe follow me on instagram at clarence Lilly and tiktok clarence.angelo again thank you guys for watching that's it